Greetings all, it's the Devious Monkey here on a glorious Monday. I needed to get the hell out of my office, so I've decided to go to Three Ships and get us some bean. And hopefully by then the rest of my packages will have been delivered. Bean has been gotten. All right, let's go deliver this, go get gas, go pick up packages, go back home and do more work. Okay kids, the package came in, I've got it. As you can see, I'm about to perform surgery. This is something that I said that I didn't want to do, but I didn't want to do it because at the time, what was available for this lens, which is the Sony 14 millimeter F 1.8 G Master, for the rear, there was only a little cutout. They gave you a little template and you had to use scissors to cut out the, like that plasticky gel paper shit to make a filter. The problem with this lens is that because it's got this big bulbous front element it does not allow you to put filters on the front in front of the lens except for you know if you get some big ass boxy thing on there which i don't want so again i didn't want to do the rear gel thing where i was trying to cut out the little plastic paper and all that shit and get it to go in there and blah blah blah, blah. at the time though they didn't have these filters available so this is the Heda rear lens nd filter kit and basically what it does, now here's, I'm basically not opening this. It comes with a screwdriver for its own screws because you're replacing your uh, plastic piece inside this lens with this piece. So what you have to do is pop this little plastic piece out here and replace it with the Heda. And then their little ND filters will fit inside the insert. And again, I wasn't going to do that because I didn't want to be dicking around with, with plastic back there. But now that they have one specific for this lens, because they used to have one for the, I think it was the 12 to 24, but it was like, well, yeah, it should work. And a lot of people complain that it didn't, but this one is specifically for the Sony 14 millimeter G Master. So I'm going to now operate on this. You got to take out a, a few screws, pop this piece of plastic out, and then put the new one in with their screws and then you're good to go. So we're gonna do that right now. So one of the things that I read about before doing this is that everyone said, make sure you have the proper screwdriver for the Sony screws because they're a different size from the one that comes with the Heda filter. They're like, make sure you have a mat sitting around or a big open area so that you can be sure to not lose these screws because they're tiny and they bounce. There, so piece of cake, it just slides right out. And now you take this one and then you have to take their screwdriver. And the one thing that you don't wanna do is remove the screw right here that goes by these contacts because that's not the way you're supposed to do it. All right, so we might as well put that one back in first. Okay, I am gonna pull this out just to make sure that I'm looking at this right. Okay, so there it is. Now that, that I've actually looked at it, it does take all three screws. Before, on the older one that wasn't made for the 14 millimeter, you could only put two screws in. So since then, they must have updated this kit and now it's good to go. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna throw all this stuff back together. Okay, all the screws are back in the original plastic piece that came with the lens. And I'm gonna put that away into this plastic ceiling thing here, which will then go inside here, which is then going to be closed off and shoved back in here. The screwdriver can also go back in there because I don't need it, but it's nice to have. All right, now the other thing that they give you here is a handy, exposure time with ND filter chart. So it, it tells you exactly which one of these ND filters you wanna put on here. So if you wanna do one, two, three, four, five, six, ten 10 stops, if you wanna do it, you know, what your shutter speed is gonna be, this is a very handy thing to have. And I will tell you right now, these things are freaking tiny. In fact, they're so small that I can't read them. All right, so we got an ND 0.9, 1.2, 1.8, and 3.0. And you do have to kind of come in from this side. There we go. 
and that's it. It's in there. So there's a little lip on this side here by the contacts. You're going to have to stick it underneath that first, and then it just flops over, and then it has this little lever that you just slide over. That's all I've got for you today, because I just now finished all my day job stuff, but I still need to pack and go downstairs and relax. And also, it's hot as freaking balls in my office because it was in the 90s today, and I have a feeling it's gonna be like this for the next several weeks. So I wanna get the hell out of here. So I'm gonna get the hell out of here. So that's all I've got for you today. If you have any comments, questions, or suggestions, leave them down below. As always, thanks for joining me. Be sure to like and subscribe. And remember kids, forward and up.